Hey everyone, looking for the best personal finance software? Today we're diving into New Cash, Quicken, and K My Money. I'll explain each one briefly, then compare them to help you decide which is best for your needs. Let's go. First up, we have New Cash. It's a free open source program for Windows, Mac OS, and Linux, designed for both personal and small business use. It uses double entry accounting for precise tracking of income, expenses, and investments. Its checkbook style interface is straightforward, but it can feel complex for beginners unfamiliar with accounting. New Cash offers robust reporting and supports multiple currencies, but lacks strong mobile support and third party integration. Next, we have Quicken. This paid software is a favorite for its user-friendly dashboard and comprehensive features. It handles budgeting, bill payments, investment tracking, and syncs seamlessly across devices and mobile. Quicken's strength is in its ease of use and excellent customer support, but it requires an annual subscription and relies heavily on an internet connection, which can be a downside. Finally, KMyMoney. Another free open source option, it's built for Linux, but also runs on Windows and Mac OS. KMyMoney mimics Quicken's intuitive layout, making it great for personal finance with features like budgeting, investment tracking, and QIF OFX imports. It's user-friendly for non-accountants, but its mobile support is limited and advanced reporting requires some effort. So how do they stack up? New Cash is powerful and free, perfect for those comfortable with double entry accounting or small businesses needing detailed reports. Quicken shines for ease of use, mobile syncing, and support, ideal for beginners or those wanting a polished experience, but it is costly. KMyMoney balances simplicity and features, making it great for Linux users or Quicken fans looking for a free alternative, though it does lack mobile functionality. Choose New Cash for free, robust accounting, Quicken for a beginner friendly paid option, or KMyMoney for a free, user friendly alternative. Let us know your pick in the comments. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more tech tips.